Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome back to RimWorld. It's that time again when we're starting a new series and this time we're calling it the RimWorld Stories. Because, I don't know, if you've been watching the ending of the previous series and you've been watching my community page, you will know that this time around we're doing it slightly different. Because if you now want to get in, it's not just enough to put your name down below. You are encouraged. It's not required, but you're encouraged. It's gonna increase your chance to get in to write a backstory for your character. It can be anything. You can write anything you want, just please not too much, you know, dirty stuff. But yeah. Uh, and whenever you get in, I will read your backstory. Some people have even started uh, drawing pictures of their characters, and I will include that as well. You can do that as well if you so desire. Also, the whole story over here today, we're playing with Alien versus Predator. So this mod is going to be our general story. This is, uh, we are playing on a planet that has been wrecked by the aliens. And now we have some of these predators coming. These are going to be our starting characters to hunt down some of these aliens. And you can be any of these races. You can, you can play as a predator if you so desire. We have Kenshi races over here. We have uh, Mass Effect races over here. I have skeletons, the pig races or whatever they are, the tree people. All kinds of good stuff. Androids, you can be whatever you so desire. Rassens, if you want to be a kitty. Um, also, look, we have more cats and dogs. So that's awesome. <laughs> so you can be anything you want. You can write your backstory. And you have to put it in the comments of the first episode. I repeat, the first episode. Because so far, I, I've repeated that a couple of times by now. And you guys have still been trying to... Uh, put those things in the community page and such no first episode comments below now also uh, there's a um, there's a chance that uh, the biggest the bigger chance you have to get in is if more people will like your story down below if, like there's likes on it and if people comment on it if if we can all see that you put some effort into it well you have a big chance to get in you know, I will all, I'll put you all on the list. I will attempt to get all of you in, as, all, as I always do. So, write your stories. Do something good with this. I don't know. Whatever you so desire, you can put in there. In your story. And since we do have the character ed uh, editor mod, I can basically edit your character. If, let's say, a normal human joins, and you're the one picked to get in. I can edit that character to, let's say, you want it to be an Arasan. I can edit it to be Arasan, I can change the backstory, I can make it missing both legs or something, if that is what your story would be. You know, I can do that in-game and we can say, hey, there it is. So whenever your character joins, I will read your backstory, I will introduce your character. And since some people were interested in, like, continuing the story, their stories, um, what I can do, so if there's episodes where nobody new joins, which there always are, I will continue to read new tidbits of your stories. If you want to continue your story, you can then uh, post more updates on the new videos as they come out. <sighs> Hopefully that will explain more. Uh, go check the latest community posts. I've talked about, about that more there. You can read that, you know, if you want some more details. Also, if you're, you know, if you don't know exactly how things are going, just Ask on Discord. We, we've talked about this on Discord a lot, so just come and speak there. Anyway, I'm also using a mod called Nature's Pretty Sweet that adds new biomes that can be actually quite laggy, but that's okay. And I wanted to play on volcanic fields because that would be kind of cool. Look, and we found one with large hills. That seems cool. Volcanic fields are also uh, always in tropical rainforest, which is, yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of that because there's more diseases, but hey, screw it. We're gonna go in volcanic fields, we're gonna make it slightly bigger map, and let's go on there. I already have the prepare carefully set up, so let's let's meet our predator. So, these are my uh, Patreon supporters that got in first. We have Nuke, Lost, Hashem, and Infinity. They are all unblooded, young blood, um, Yauntia race, I think they're called. Basically predators, right? And these guys came to this planet, that's the whole story over here, these guys they came to this planet and found it that the aliens have all run it and the humanity is just spread out in just tiny villages, that's all that remains of the whole population and they decide they will hunt down all those aliens and they will also help 
people survive which is kind of not in character with them but they realize that they will need humans help as well uh, if they wanted to get through this so yeah we have nuke lost hashem infinity my top patreon supporters coming in there and you patreons if you want your special backstories those of you that haven't gotten in yet uh you can also do that you know if you so desire anyway we start with uh some xenomorph tail spear some melee weapon and some yontia hunting bows for our people because that's that's what they're called i don't know so that was a lot of speaking let's actually get to the part where we play the game shall we let's let's go but yeah i'm i'm really excited to see the backstories from you guys because uh a lot of you, I know, have started writing, and uh, I'm excited about it. Oh, look at that. We already have a base pretty much set up over here. So, let's let's take a look around. That's some uh, nasty volcanic fields out there. Now, I believe when uh, it rains, these will actually, like, fill up. And there's going to be, like, steam fissures that you can use. Kind of like steam geysers, but they don't last forever. So, uh... It's been probably like two years since I played last with this mod, so must much have uh, probably changed since then. But that's okay. All right, yeah, this is this is perfect actually. We already have a nice base setup. Look at that. How about this? Uh, I'm playing with uh, which which uh, miscellaneous map stuff, something like that. I don't know. Check the mod list. Uh, and that sometimes adds ruins, but this one is really elaborate. Look at that. You have Cinder block chess table as well, and there's even a bed over there and two beds It's so everything is cinder block though. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I believe Hashem is our melee person. So you get the xenomorph Spear that was lost not Hashem. I'm sorry. I don't know why I said that Okay, you guys grab this. Let's unforbid everything Good all right they are they are looking scary as hell. Now I think next thing we do is we claim this bad boy. That is now ours. That is now ours. We're gonna home zone this, which already has been home zoned. I really don't want those lava fields to be in the home zone because I don't really want anybody trying to, you know, clean them or something. But that's that's pretty good. Uh, pretty good start, I'd say. We have some steel. So let's fit in some uh, maybe steel structures, Street steel walls over here just to block some of this off and we can indeed use some of that. So we make this an actual house. Somebody's gonna have a bit of lava in their uh, bedroom. No pressure there, it's all good. It's all good, we're gonna do that. Let's maybe have a... A door back here as well, huh? How about that? Yeah, that wouldn't be so bad. Let's reinstall these. And let's go... Something like that. That seems smart. Let's reinstall this over here. And let's reinstall this over here. That seems like a good start. Okay. You guys start working. Let's uh, set up priorities. Uh, let's keep everybody on construction, but Infinity seems to be the best constructor. Everybody is allowed to firefight. Uh, Hashem is our best doctor. Everybody else be a patient. You will keep to be that. Maintaining vats is not something we're gonna be doing quite yet. I think people are puking right now, which is far from good. Uh, I don't know which mod adds this rearming stuff. But uh, it's totally new to me, so that's okay. You're our social person, aren't you, Nuke? Interesting. Uh, Lost seems to be our main cook. Everybody is allowed to hunt right now. Actually, uh, Lost is not. Uh, fishing? I don't know if we have any actually any water around. No, it does not appear to be the case. So, no fishing right now. Uh, grower is gonna be you. Hashem is our grower. And we have crafter and researcher over here on Nuke. So you craft, research. Uh, what is lost job? Lost is a cook. Hold on. After that, I don't really need anybody else on. Oh, on artistism, definitely not. Everybody can be a miner. Who else? Who's gonna be our main miner though? Because I have a feeling we're gonna have to do some mining. Nobody then, huh? 
fun. Okay. Good. I think that's a good start. Let's uh, speed things up for our boys. And um, since we don't really need all of these doors over here, let's uh, grab these doors and reinstall them there. And yes, you guys are allowed to build some roofs over here. Now, the only thing that might be missing over where we at right now is some semblance of crafting. And by crafting, I mean... Uh, growing fields. I don't know why I said crafting, but hey. Okay, we're gonna start growing some stuff. Yeah, you can't grow there. Of course, that would make sense. So let's go with a couple of fields. One of these. Um, hmm. We want something like that. One of that. And we're gonna get one like this okay okay makes complete sense give me some rice over here give me some uh, corn over here and give me some heal root over here if I could find it good of course before we do anything else this needs to be floored with some tilled soil so we actually get some proper growing stuff going good all right let's begin there is a uh, Really low amount of wood around here, huh? I think we're gonna be hurting for wood, but I would like to chop some of that off. Good. Uh, you guys have brought in stuff. We have a couple of beds. We're gonna need one more. We can't really make it out of cinder blocks, so hopefully they will get us some wood. And we can make one bed over here. Please make this a bedroom as well. Thank you. All right, let's uh, let's do this, and I think we have a night owl. Somebody, I think, is a night owl. Yep, that would be Nuke. So let's say Nuke. Let's do this first, and then Nuke is gonna be two, four, six, something like that. And we're gonna give you, let's say, who do you like? Who do you like? Uh, you like infinity the most okay that seems fine actually infinity doesn't really like you yeah so maybe I uh, lost oh infinity is fine I'm sure infinity is gonna be fine so we're gonna we're gonna get infinity to be night person as well so you guys can chill there you go there you go uh, unfortunately that is our main constructor isn't it Asham is eaten out here. That's not the best. Let's have you work on this. So he's got his bedroom set up. We have daylilies uh, planted over here. Yeah, it's not really that important right now. Let's go get a stockpile over yonder. We're going to have a stockpile just for stuff there. And uh, there is definitely a bed missing. And by bed, I mean table missing over there. So how about we get a nice table look at that we're actually getting wood how beautiful is that just uh, reinstall these bad boys down here okay you're bringing the goods in perfection um, definitely don't need these plant scraps not need it please plant scraps get out of here Get out of here. All right, let's get a dumping stockpile maybe back here. You can dump some stuff. But uh, hey, this is this is nice. We have a semblance of a base now. It's pretty dark, unfortunately. So what we have is medicine, some resources, and that bed has also been built. We're going to need some power. We're going to need some light. Oh, over here. You see, there's a steam vent over here. That's the one I was talking about. There's another one over here kind of cool now in the power where's the power we have the steam generator you see this is uh, different why do we not have any components on us that's kind of sad uh, we're gonna need to find some components right now looks like we didn't crash with any that's okay uh, I use the resources that uh, these uh, Yautias have at the start why is there so many precious materials over here and no components there's the components do we have anybody that's uh, gonna be a major component producer over here for us? What is this? Amber? Ooh, Amber. That's kind of cool. 
It's, it's really dark, by the way. Okay, let's go grab these components over here. Vein miner, forward to win. Grab the components and grab these components. All right, continue. Now, who was the miner? That would be lost. That would be lost. Who's bringing in some stuff? But yeah, this over here is gonna get built. Uh, we're gonna need some uh, batteries probably. Industrial cable, huh? Yeah, we're not we're not going there. We're not going quite there. So let's get this power going in here. I don't know exactly how much this produces, but there's a lot of these steam vents over here, which I really do appreciate. Oh, it's overcast. That's uh, why it's so dark. Oh, it, the output is 400. It's better than nothing. It is better than nothing. Uh, we do have some wall lights over here that we could use to light up this place. Not have it so extremely freaking dark. You know, might be smart to do something like that. I'd like to get some lights in the bedrooms. Okay, now, that all done. Is there any wildlife on the map? There is. I would like to make a fridge for us. We could use this as a kitchen and this over here could be a fridge. I think that would be solid. That would be indeed solid. So let's get, uh, let's get another wall uh, freezer over here. Something like this will do. We're just gonna grab all of these, I think, and just gonna reinstall in here. That's not gonna be like the most amazing freezer you ever saw, but it's, it's better than nothing. What's the speed of uh, this door? Oh, God, oh, don't. Just don't, don't, don't use that. That's horrible. That is horrible. Ex especially when it comes to a fridge. No, we don't want that. Definitely don't want that. Let's get this bad boy going over here. We're gonna drop you down to negative degrees. And we're gonna have ourselves a stockpile zone in here. It's gonna be clear all. And it's gonna be food. Don't allow rotten. It's gonna be food and it's gonna be animal corpses. But not rotten. Thank you. And plants crabs are not allowed rotted mush not allowed not allowed thank you do that so that should do you take 200 and you take 10 how about we build more of these bad boys looks like there's uh there's a couple available down here so that's kind of cool i like these steam vents very useful, very useful. Hashem is planting uh, our resources. Now, wildlife is something we can uh, attempt hunting because we do have these Yautias who are pretty cool. Salamanders, right. That is a mod that is added. Uh, that is a creature that is added through this mod. It's pretty cool. Okay, uh, who's going to be our main hunter when it comes to that? Maybe Hashem? Maybe Infinity? Let's do infinity. Infinity is not doing anything else. So when you're not building, go hunt infinity. I would appreciate that. Because we're gonna need some proper hunters, hunter action going on. All right, let's go uh, get ourselves a kitchen stove over here. Like this will do. I know it's pretty small, but hey. And a butcher's table. Sure, I guess I guess we can put it in here. That's gonna make our fridge smaller. I know, I know. But it's better than nothing. It's better than nothing. Let's build uh, this bad boy over here. Let's build this bad boy over here. Oh, it's raining. Okay, that might lag out the game. Because you can see lava is disappearing now. And it's uh, being switched in by basalt. But at some point, that's gonna that's gonna get ranked the other way around again, and uh, we're gonna see lava again. So be careful where you build, cause you get you might get uh, lava fight. You know, <laughs> um, that's interesting. Also, uh, because this soil is now wet, it's more fer fertile than before. Oh, look, wet rich soil is. Oh Jesus. Okay, 
Nuke, you probably should not live in here. Get out of here. Get out of here. That's a bad room. That's a very bad room. Um, yeah. Run out here. Jeebus. Jeebus. Oh, is Laws doing it? Okay. Whew. Oh my god. <laughs> that was... That was horrible. That's... That room. Do... Do this quickly. Um... Remove the roof area on top of this, so this can turn into basalt as well. Come on. Somebody. Look, it's... It's cooking. Come on, remove the roof area. Did you do it? That lava is obnoxious. But okay, whatever. Who is hunting? And where is somebody hunting? Is that you? Yeah, you're hunting. Over here, cool. Um, did anybody treat Nuke? No. Nobody treated Nuke. Who's our doctor? Hashem. Would you mind treating Nuke? Infinity is also hunting. You guys are terrible with these bows, aren't you? Jesus. Well, that was a snipe. Right, I forgot about... Hey, where's the... The corner of the map looks weird. Slightly, isn't it? Isn't it dark usually? I don't know. Uh, I forgot about toilets, as I always do. So, let's get a toilet. Okay, that thing changed. Very good. Very good. Maybe you can have a toilet in there. Yes. Where did we put that steel thing? Put this back here. Let's, uh... Let's build a roof area on top of it again. And we're gonna do a toilet in there. I, I always forget about this. There's no question about it. I will always forget about setting up toilets. It's just the way it is. We do have water around here, though. Let's build a well outside. Let's do these things. Good. Okay. Just bad hygiene for now. This is acceptable. Uh, let's butcher creatures do it forever. Uh, why is 12 degrees in here? Why is 20 degrees in here? Why is it making it so... Oh, we have a steam vent right underneath this. Oh, that's obnoxious. You know? That is truly obnoxious. Let's do that. Truly obnoxious, you know? Infinity. The final straw was unblooded. Really now? I need to prove myself by hunting and killing a worthy foe. Uh, did you get yourself blooded? Lost? I guess lost did it. Hashem is still unblooded. And you're also you also need to pee. Well that's that's a thing, yeah. Would you please uh, work on that for me? Work on this for me. Work on that for me. Work on this for me. And then do that. That should do it now. That should do it. Stop being so unblooded, people. There you go. Good. We have some of that. We're gonna cook simple meals, I think. Cook four simple meals. And do it... Um, two per colonist, maybe. Yeah. Just do three per colonist. And we're gonna build one of these bad boys. Yeah, dual is much more worth it than single boy. Let's do this over there. Okay, uh, how much? We are producing 800 power. And you have 200 extra. I don't know how much this one takes, but that's okay. That is okay. If it is no longer having a tantrum. Well, how about that? Who is my uh, constructor? Oh, Infinity. Well, why don't you ask? <laughs> he wrecked everything. He wrecked everything. Now also, I want to make this my home zone. 
because we are growing down here and I want to make this my home zone yeah let's keep going boys let's keep going so infinity you gonna make that toilet yeah you are chunks of spacecraft now I believe through these chunks of spacecraft the aliens might come now I'm not 100% sure but they might you're hunting a turtle huh eat yourself bloated man okay we have our meals in there which is good storage uh, meal yeah no packet survival meals good simple meal nutrient paste lavish meal fine meal I accept this also we have sushi and such allowed okay good there you go they're gonna clean themselves over here they have a place to piss if they need to right there their bedrooms are not exactly amazing but uh, it is what it is and we're gonna hunt some animals which they're there's some salamanders we're gonna hunt them until we are ready to not hunt them yeah there's that's a lot of these uh these guys are over here but i don't know what happens exactly when uh, lava returns so don't necessarily wanna just grab them all okay now gear wise these guys have their yautia stuff i don't know if they can actually carry anything else that's a thing i don't know if they can actually carry anything else also, I don't know why some of them can go to plus 3, some of them can go to minus 10. I don't know. It's interesting. They all should have like camel hide stuff, right? Yeah. Huh. I don't know. I don't know exactly. Okay. Uh, they will need some joy stuff as well. So let's give them uh, recreation. Let's start with a horseshoe pin. Everybody likes a horseshoe pin. Right over here will do. Put it there. And since we are doing lights, how about a light over here? How are we doing on uh, power right now? We do have uh, 177 extra. So, yeah, let's get a light. Let's get a light in the darkness so these two can actually grow and have some plumerias growing in there. Good. You guys hunt the wildlife, hunt the salamanders, butcher the rats and such. Good. Uh, next thing I want is get some furniture going, maybe. Uh, you know what? You guys have those beds. That will do for now. How about we go with a tailor bench? Looks like we used all of our wood. Do we have enough bone now? We already have enough bone. Oh, that's so good. I'm going to start with a tailor bench because I have a feeling we're going to need that in no time. This is minus 7, minus 8. Good. That is acceptable. This fridge over here turned out not to be in the perfect spot, but hey. What you doing, Nuke? Playing horseshoes? Okay. What you doing, Lost? Cleaning trash. That is also acceptable. Very, very much acceptable. Uh, I would love to get some more wood, so... If you could find some that is actually grown, get that. Get that, boys. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now, we are playing on Randy with the highest difficulty settings, so uh, we're going to need to be prepared for raids that are going to crash into us. So I think, instead of having these uh, these things in the corners, how about we rather go ahead and we reinstall some of these around here, so we have a nice defensive setup back here. You know, around this side of the base, we can squat up around here and use some of that maybe and maybe we can do the same on this side that wouldn't be so bad now would it i don't know let's rather do actually no let's do this let's do that yeah oh people's amalgamation of queria and pantoon you know what that's fine with me Grab this one, put it there, put this one there, put this one here. Let's go like this, and we don't really want an extra one somewhere where the nasties can use it. Definitely don't want that, now do we? Now I could block this off, but then it slows us going out of here. So, do this, and also, I would prefer not to be slowed out here as well. So actually, let's just do this. Not exactly amazing, but it is what it is. 
That's what it is. Now, for some production, we could also go with... Where's my quarry? So, you can, we can quarry a lot of stuff around here. We're gonna be just getting basalt. But we can quarry a lot of stuff. So, maybe having a quarry go over here. That wouldn't be so bad. We do have a dumping stockpile on this side, huh? Hmm. Let's rather... Let's, um... Uh, Let's put a dumping stall stockpile over here. Delete that one. Because we're gonna we're gonna want to use some of that basalt, right? If we can get our stone cutter stable. Can we make it out of bone? We do have enough bone. We could just drop that one outside for now. It's not the most useful uh, thing, having it outside, but hey. Uh, but you know what? We could also have it inside. Yeah. We could also have it inside. Let's uh, let's reinstall this one over here, and let's see if you can actually make people wear something else. If you can make some uh, ponchos, because I think we're gonna have like quite hot stuff. Where are my ponchos? There are my ponchos. So if you can make some ponchos, it requires 75 ingredients, of which we have zero. Okay, we're not making ponchos. Can we still make just normal dusters? We should be able to make normal dusters, right? Yeah, there's the duster. We have leather to make dusters, right? We need 80 ingredients and we have, well, we have enough for one duster. So let's make one duster for now. That will do. Yeah, you, you drop that there. You drop all of that there. Good. So we have some meals. Somebody reinstalled us. And we'll see if somebody can make us a duster. Where is everybody? Oh, you're holding the wood up here. Okay, that's that's acceptable. Uh, we're going to have our first rice hookup. That's great. There's no wildlife out there, which is not so great. People still have to use the wood latrine, which is also far from great. But hey, this is what it is, you know. This is the way it is. Power-wise, we're solid right now. Although it wouldn't hurt having a couple more of these bad boys. Kind of like these uh, tiny setups. We have a manhunter pack. It's not great. Hunting cobras. Okay. How many cobras is this? That's 12 fucking cobras. And lost is right there. Jeepus. Okay. Ultron the cobras lost. Get back here, boys. You seem to be pretty fast, my dude. Okay. Hmm. There's a good chance Cobras will want to come through here. Let's let's see if you can position this way. I don't even see where they are. There they are. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus, this is gonna be bad. You hit any? How much damage does this thing thing do? This thing thing? Um, I wanted to check this. 3.18 only? Oh boy, oh boy, this is... Um, I think we're gonna evacuate. Get in here. Nuke! Did you guys shoot Nuke? For fuck's sake. And you guys let them in though. That's not acceptable. How are you doing, Nuke? Are you mailing as well? Okay, that's all the Cobras done inside, right? Okay, Lost, get over here. Don't shoot Lost, though. Stop shooting at Lost. You weirdos. Nice. Nice snipes. Good, I think we got them all. Alright. Uh, ooh, Blooded Unmarked Cobra. Interesting. You get bitten by a cobra. Blooded unmarked cobra. I don't know what that means, but I think they, they got some cobra tattoos or something like that. Okay, Lost is probably our best doctor, isn't it? No, it's not. It's Hashem. Good. Hashem, then to Lost. Oh, great. Uh, two of our males are not going to be happy. Grab these cobras. Bring them in. Okay, it wasn't so bad wasn't nearly as bad bring the cobras in there and butcher them 
butcher them cobras before they go bad. Uh, we get lizard skin out of that, so we should get some... Uh, that's 30 lizard skin. No, no, that was less. Well, you might get a duster or two out of these cobras. New worthy kills. Yautia with new worthy kills. Nuke on cobra. Make sure that they mark themselves if desired. Okay, how do you do this? How do I make you mark yourself? I don't know. Hmm. I do not know how you mark yourself. I'm sure you'll figure it out, Nuke. Uh, I believe in you. I wanted this, though. That Cobra is also allowed to be brought in. Good stuff. Good stuff. Alright. We gotta get some uh, food. I would like to make you marked. Also, what is forbidden over here? Where's there a Cobra forbidden over there? Oh, can you... Ah, do this. Okay, so. Okay, so he's marked. Can you mark yourself with something? Oh, I see now why some of them have been forbidden. I like this. But Nuke has been marked. This is acceptable. It was a worthy kill. Killing of Cobra. A bunch of lizard skin coming in. Oh yeah, that's that's a bunch of lizard skin. Who is my tailor? That would be Nuke. Nuke, I will need you tailoring. Get your ass tailoring. I want to see if these guys can wear dusters. Are you kidding me? You kidding me? Hashem. Tent. Is that the poison on the on the floor, or is that? No, that's their that's their green blood. Oh, I love this. It's pretty cool. That is pretty freaking cool. Law's got a break risk. I'm sure you're gonna be fine though. We got good uh, meds. You're gonna you're gonna get immunity going in no time. In no time, I believe in you. Now I don't know if these guys can wear dusters. That's why we're making one, just to figure it out. Because they are a different race, they might not... Oh, it's an excellent lizard skin duster. Hey, that's pretty cool. Although, I believe they do have the outer layer already. In this uh, chest plate. You know? Okay, they can't. Okay, makes sense. That's fine. I'm fine with this. Why is rice in the dumping stockpile? Are you effing kidding me? What? Why would you put it there? Because this is also normal. Of course. Of course. Indeed. Don't have it there, though. Don't have it there. Uh, I'm sure you guys have your reasons, but just don't. Okay? Grab the rice. Put it where it belongs. Because we're going to need it for food reasons. There you go. Okay. Now, I did not assign anybody to haul urgently, did I? Uh, let's see, my grower, I think my constructor doesn't need haul urgently, everybody else can haul urgently. Yeah. There you go, you've done it. The man, the myth, the legend. Okay, it is okay degrees in here, although I think this, the steam geyser outside of here causes this one to have slight issues. But that's okay. That's okay. All right. All right, all right, all right. Lost is gonna be fine, right? I mean, we can also take off your finger if that needed be, but uh, does not need it. In treatment, Hashem's gonna fix him up. Good. What is our uh, power situation? Oh, we have plenty because we build that extra thing. Good. Let's go ahead and build some of these in your bedrooms. I would like that. I would like that very much because it's right now. It's pretty freaking dark. It's like a drone is ending. Good. All right. I think it's very much past time we build a research bench. Very much so. Let's build it uh, right there. Seems appropriate. We're going to be making any stone blocks over here forever. You could make concrete and such as well at some point. There's a research and we're going to be researching what? What do we start with? 
Well, we probably want to get down this way as soon as possible. What about some batteries? Let's go that way. All right. Wow, we are 40 minutes in. That's that's probably way too long. So how about how about I remind you of the backstories? Put them in the comments below of this episode. Just this this episode. Put it in the comments below and make sure there's there. Why is this a stockpile zone and not a dumping stockpile zone? It's beyond me because uh, we copied the dumping stockpile zone. Jesus Christ. Ah, <sighs> but yes, in the comment below, please. Put, put that there put your names there okay put your names there and put your backstories there and I will I will include you and I will read your backstories and I'm sure it's gonna be lots of fun actually doing that so for now though thank you buddy for watching hope you enjoyed it I will record first three episodes preemptively so you guys have time uh, getting your backstory set up and after that we're gonna start including them for now though thank you everybody for watching hope you enjoyed it click the notification bell below if you want to see more from me and if you're not subscribed you're free to do that as well but for now thanks for watching i'll see you guys next time joker out